Hi, in this video we're going to talk about how to build a completely waterproof bird house camera watching system. Why waterproof is so important for a bird box camera? We have run a test in a previous video. If the camera is not waterproof, it's very easy to get wet and eventually damage the camera. According to our repair record, the waterproof is the primary issue. Here we got the waterproof camera built into this bird house. Now not only the camera, but also the whole system. So we are talking about the cable, the connector. Okay, now let's just start from the AC outlet. This is the outdoor tight waterproof PO, the adapter. It provides the AC to DC. So from here, you see there's a rubber to keep the water out. After we attach to the, the pigtail cable to the PO, the adapter, you need to lock this to make sure the water is not going to damage the connector. Now this is the 10 meter extension cable. So we can use the 10 meter extension cable to lo locate the AC outlet. Even if it's not close to the bird house, it still work. We also have the rubber to keep the water out. And this is the same lock. The cable is very tight, so we can bury the cable underground. And for all this 10 meter extension cable, let's just move to the bird house. Here we got two terminal. One is the power. So we also need to have the same lock. Now everything is tight. This is the reset button. Just make sure you cover the reset button. Otherwise, the, it may get rust inside. It will not work. Okay, now let's move to the camera. And we have installed the micro SD card. So there's one thing to use this 3 and tape to cover the SD card slot to keep the water out. Okay. Let me just just cover the micro sticker slot. That will be good. Now the whole system is waterproof, and we also can go to the S and see the live video. Now the camera is live. Let me just turn the direction a little bit. So in order to have the whole system waterproof, not only the camera, but also the connection from the power data to the extension cable, and also the pigtail of the camera, make sure everything you have take care of it. So it will be fine to keep the camera outside for a whole season. All right. That's all for today's video. If you have any question, please leave a comment section below. See you next time.